Hey guys, it's Melanie. Happy Sunday. So today I have a review for you of Key Lime Pie from the Sonoma Goods for Life candle line that they sell at Kohl's. I'm so late to the game with this candle. I kept seeing this all over Instagram and all over the YouTube candle reviewer communities um, like a couple months ago and I was like it can't be that good and so I just never went and sought it out and about a week and a half ago I was inside Kohl's looking at something else and I just saw the candle sitting there and I was like all right I'm gonna go sniff it out oh my gosh <laughs> Immediately, I went and bought every one that they had, which was three. <laughs> I brought it home and I lit it up and I have been blown away by how good this candle is, you guys. Obviously, I'm really excited. <laughs> it's so good. Everything that you have heard about it, it's, it's totally spot on, you guys. So... Um, in terms of how much I paid for this, I these candles regularly sell for $19.99. That's like the regular price. But right now, they are on sale at Kohl's for $9.99. And as far as I know, they go on sale fairly frequently. So I would never pay $19.99 for it. Plus, Kohl's always seems to have a 20% off coupon or a 10 off of 50 coupon floating around somewhere. So do your research and make sure that you are not paying full price or even necessarily half price for this candle because you don't have to. In terms of the amount of wax in here, um, this is a 14 ounce wax, um, 14 ounces of wax. So it's pretty comparable in terms of size to the Bath & Body Works candles. And I would have to say that the burn time seems to be just a little bit better than Bath & Body Works. I am at below the halfway point with this candle right now. I just, I can't stop burning it. So <laughs> I actually went online and ordered a bunch more. I know, it's ridiculous, but it's that good, you guys. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and read you guys the description. By the way, the... Um, these are four inches tall, these glass jars, and they do come with a very plain lid, and I'm just gonna pop that in the frame here. So this is the lid. Um, so, and they are three wick candles, by the way. So um, the, the, the glass jar is slightly, I wanna say, fluted in a way. It's a little bit wider at the top than it is at the bottom, but you can barely tell. I think it's a matter of like a quarter of an inch or something like that, if that. But it, I do find that this does help the pool and the overall burn of the candle. By the way, there is no sooting, no, um, there's no mushroom tops that form. Like, it just, it burns flawlessly. <laughs> Each time that I've burned it, it has pooled out perfectly like didn't have to put foil around it didn't even have to put it in a luminary it just burns flawlessly on its own I'm really impressed with the burn overall let's get into the scent description because that's obviously the most important part here so they say on the bottom of the candle that key lime is mixed with vanilla and a sugared graham crust and topped with a smooth whipped cream for a refreshing fragrance okay I have heard people compare this to Fruit Loops cereal, and I can totally see where someone would get Fruit Loops cereal. Um, that is definitely there, but this is a very nice, smooth, citrusy lime scent that has a solid vanilla base to it. Um, I don't necessarily get that graham crust note. It really does smell almost like cereal in that aspect, I guess. Um, but that lime is just really, what's the best way to, mm, it's smooth, it's, it smells very legit to me, <laughs> if you will. It, it does have that key lime scent to it. You know, regular limes to me are not quite as sweet smelling as key limes, so it definitely is that key lime versus just like a regular straight up lime. 
type of scent. Um, but it does have a good amount of vanilla in it, so it's not harsh. It doesn't smell like a cleaner. Citrus, to me, a lot of times smells like bathroom cleaner or something like that. This does not even have a remote hint of that. It's just so smooth and yummy. Honestly, it smells incredible, you guys. I love this scent so much, and I hope that they continue to keep this um, as a... A fragrance within the line because it's so nice and I know so many people love it um the throw of this candle is a eight and a half like I can smell it in the upstairs of my house it's it's so strong um the throw is amazing the strength is perfect as well it's also about I would say an eight and a half nine it's it's pretty dang strong you guys so I can smell it throughout the entire house when I light it downstairs in the dining room. It just goes everywhere. It's really kind of the perfect candle, you guys. <laughs> it's not headache inducing um, because I, I don't think the scent itself leads itself, lends itself to be headache inducing in any kind of way. It, it just smells good. All I, all I can say is go to Kohl's, find a Kohl's, pick this sucker up and smell it. What you get on cold sniff is very similar to what it smells like burning, but I would say warmer, if that makes sense. Like more rich, um, a little bit more sweet maybe when you're burning it. And that vanilla really does come through a little bit more. On cold sniff, I get more, more lime, but when it's burning, you get a, a more lime vanilla whipped creamy type mix yeah sorry I have a cold I have a just a, a regular guy back here that's not burning so there's a definite difference um but just if you like it on cold sniff you'll probably like it burning it's it's a really nice fruity bakery type scent it's it's great for this time of year so so happy that I decided to finally try it and drink the kool-aid <laughs> The Key Lime Kool-Aid. Um, I'm in love. Let me know if you've tried this one and what your thoughts are. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.